earlier you were shaken out of bed, not literally out of bed. You were woken up. I don't think anybody had any injuries or no. maybe just a few things off but the shelf. But you sure felt it. Yeah, all of you felt it, and you, uh, a lot of you woken up from this. The USGS confirms there was a 4.4 magnitude earthquake, followed by a 3.3 magnitude quake near Decatur, Tennessee. The first happened around 4.15 this morning. The second, just before 4.30, people felt it from Knox County to Atlanta, Georgia, to North Carolina, to Kentucky. It was really, it seemed to be like there was a pretty wide impact felt mm -hmm. by this thing. Yeah, According to the National Weather Service in Morristown, the 4.4 earthquake is now the second strongest on record here in East Tennessee. The strongest was a 4.7 near Maryville back in 1973, and we got a huge response from you on our WBR Facebook page. Gary Cup says, I live a few miles north of Jellico in Kentucky. He said it shook the house and it rattled the windows there. Valerie Canada Rose says her dog growled and barked because, hey, it it's waking up the pets too. And Michelle Henderson Torrance says it woke her out of a sound sleep, which is like <laughs> a lot of people. A lot of people were up at 4.30 this morning with us saying, hey, I felt it. I'm telling you, I'm kind of laughing because I'm looking through my Twitter feed, my Instagram feed, my Facebook feed, just mine. The WBIR account has just gone crazy over this. Just mine. It's like I'm getting people from <laughs> all over the region who are tweeting yeah. me this morning uh, talking no, about this quake. Well, I called Cassie because our WBIR weather page was blowing up as well. And I was like, can you help? I know it's really early. And she's like, why? It's, what's going on? There's nothing going on weather wise. And I said, no, we had the second strongest earthquake to hit East Tennessee. And she's like, oh, I thought I felt something, but I thought maybe I just hit my head or hit my oh, hand yeah. on something. And I was like, I think that's what a lot of people, unless you were really up, maybe it was just something that kind of seemed like, wait, am I dreaming? What's going on? And a lot of people were asking us about that. But yes, if you're just waking up, we did have two earthquakes hit this morning. Let's kind of break down that graphic one more time and explain just a few more things. So we had a 4.4, 3.3. The strongest on record was back in 1973 in Maryville, and that was a 4.7. What we had this morning was the second strongest in East Tennessee's USGS database. And we did have one more that happened in 1987 in Bonnour. That was over a 4.0 magnitude. Uh, but but overall, this morning, what we had is something that we'll be talking about for at least uh, the next few days. There's a look at the map where it did happen in Meigs County. More information of 4.4, 3.3. It happened at 414 and 427. Ed, this is a little bit closer to your neck of the woods. Wondering if this woke you up out of a deep sleep. How are the roads looking as well? Hey, Becca, good morning. No, I didn't know anything about it until you just told me. <laughs>